Hi guys, happy Friday to you. Wow, there's so many people joining. How's everybody doing? It's Friday, end of the week. It's a good time to be alive. Amidst everything that's going on, amidst the calamities that you may be facing. It's just a good time to be alive, guys. It's a good time to be alive. How's everybody doing? Wow, there's so many people joining in. I'm doing well. I'm doing well. It's been a long week, so many challenges besides trading. But uh, God is good, guys. God is good. I'm doing well. How's your week been? How's you can drop you can drop uh, you can drop something in the comments, guys. How's your week been? Are you colored? I'm Indian. I'm Indian. But how's everybody doing? How's the week been? I got into a buy at the open and I took uh, took some pups on the trade, so I'm out of the trade. Charts are closed. Charts are closed, guys. We get back on the charts on Sunday. Do you use investing.com for your strategy? Yes, I do. I do use investing.com. Good question. And yes, I do. Tell us about your story. Okay, I can do that. Can definitely do that. XAUSD killed. Well done to you for the gold traders. I know for the past week, uh, the guys have been killing gold. The gold traders have been killing it. Well done to you. I need to join your signals. Holding some partial profits. Well done, well done. Well done, guys. What about CNBC? Yes, I do use CNBC too. Guys, get your hands on enough news apps that you can. Why only NASDAQ in US 30? You know, when I started off trading, um, I used to only trade currencies. Uh, GBP, JPY, I think I mentioned this before and I also used to trade a lot of gold, you know, gold was quite good and um, eventually when I when I switched over uh, to trading NASDAQ, you know, I just fell in love with NASDAQ and the volatility of it and, and it's three years now and I've never looked back uh, to trading currencies, you know, it's just I've, found, I've, I've, I've formed a um, a bonding uh, with NASDAQ and the way it moves, US 30 as well, but still, you know, NASDAQ is my main, my main source. Who, who inspired you to start trading? You know, it's, it's a very good question, right? Let me, let me tell you why, because you see, uh, sometimes in life, and I'm going to going to talk about this. Let me just move my seat to the back. Uh, yeah, that's much better. So you know, sometimes in life, okay, there are people who inspire you, and there are also your circumstances that exp uh, that inspire you. Okay, so for me, I wouldn't say that a singular person inspired me to start trading. Because then what we tend to do, which we must not do, we must not idolize people. Okay, guys, it's a very good uh, and important thing that I'm mentioning here. You must not idolize people, which means that you must not idolize me. You must not idolize another person. Don't uh, idolize a businessman. Don't idolize a person with a lot of money. Don't idolize people. Guys, that's what you must not do. 
the reason why I started trading and, and one of the reasons what propelled me to start trading was I found needs within myself that motivated me to trade. I knew that I didn't want to be poor. I wanted to break the gener generational curse in my life of being poor. I wanted to break the generational curse in my life of not having money. I wanted to, to break the generational curse in my life of not having enough. I wanted to get out of the place of saying I cannot do this or I can't do that. And the only way for me to do that at that point in which I was looking for a way out, I found trading and I found Forex. To be, to be poor, it's, there's nothing wrong with that. But also, it's a choice that you make. You have a choice to be poor or you have a choice to be successful. If you want to work hard, you will become successful. But if you want to be lazy, guys, you will stay poor. Poverty is not something that comes from generations. Or maybe it does. But poverty is a choice. As well as wealth is a choice. To acquire wealth, you don't need any person. You don't need Joash. You don't need any other person to help you along the journey. To acquire wealth, everything that you need is within yourself. So the moment I began to understand that, I shifted my focus of being inspired by everybody else and I looked for myself. I looked deep down for inspiration. Because whatever you need to do and all of the keys that you need is found within yourself. It's not found in another person, guys. That's, that's, that's what I want to mention. You see, the reason why I'm here on this live is not to, not to praise anybody. It's not to praise any other forex trader. It's not to praise me. It's not to praise yourself. But it's to empower you and to convict you and to motivate you that everything you need is found within you. Everything you need is found within you. And that's, that's, that's a fact, guys. Everything that you need, all of the tools, everything is found within your mind. Your mind controls your whole body. Everything that, that happens, happens in the mind first. At that millisecond, it reacts, your body reacts to it. So everything that you need is in the mind. So guys, stop looking to others. It's good, it's good to, 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 to look at others. But also another thing, you see, we all have plans, we all have goals, we all have aims, we, are all have, all, we have all of these great things that we want to accomplish. But at the same time, guys, I think I mentioned this in Tanzania when I was there and I'm mentioning it here again, is that make sure that your goals and plans are not somebody else's. Because you are not somebody else, you are yourself. You get me? You are not somebody else, you are yourself. Which means that you are unique to yourself. That means the way you look is unique to you. The way you walk is unique to you. The way you speak is unique to you. The way you think is unique to you. So what you have and what God has given you, the way you are, you must adapt that and use those tools within you to improve your life. Because guys, depending on other people just gets you to a certain point. It gets you to a certain point where you plateau, where you, where, you, where you just level out. And I know many people, even on the Zoom right now, sorry, on this, on this live uh, right now, there's like 470 people on this live, 500 people on this live. Right now, a lot of you have feel that you right now have just burnt out. you on sort of a plateau, which means you're just on a level surface where you are not going any further up in your trading. You are not going any further down. Not only trading, in your whole life, every aspect of your life, you feel like you are not improving, you are not getting worse, you are just there at a constant. And guys, many of us, what we do is we, we look for other people for, for a key, for, 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 for some sort of direction to find the way forward so that we can level up. 
And I want to say to you today, guys, that that key is sometimes not found in another person. That key is found within you. Within you, you have to build up, build up that energy in order to step into the next level. And with that, guys, again and again, I would always say this, God plays a big part. You know, right now, many people might be saying that, that you know, God is not helping me. God is not doing anything for me. A lot of people right now um, uh, have, have stopped believing in God. I know at one point in my life, I was in the brink and I was at the position where I thought uh, and, and I, had, I had the mindset that God doesn't love me. God doesn't have anything good for me. But guys, I want to say this and I, if, if you just understand this one thing, it's going to change your life right now. You see, it all starts by you doing something. God is willing to take 10 steps for you, but He's waiting for you to take one step. I want to repeat that again. God is willing to take 10 steps for you, but He's waiting for you to take one step. And if you can only understand the magnitude of that, if you can understand the magnitude of that right now, it's going to help you tenfold. It's going to help you than anything else I can talk about trading. It's going to help you uh, more than anything that I can ever say to you. If you are willing to take one step, God will take 10 steps for you. There's somebody talking about darkness before sunrise, 100%. But in order to step towards the light, in order to step into the bright in, st in order to step into, the, into good things, into greener pastures, you first have to take that step. And then God will propel you 10, ten steps ahead. And if you just catch that, guys, that, that, is, that is it. That is it. That is it. If I could leave anything with you today, more than trading, more than strategies, more than techniques, more than anything else, that's what I would leave to you. Everything that is found, everything that you need, everything that you, you want to acquire in life is found within you. It's found in your mind. The mind allows you to, to, to activate and to unlock ways in order to achieve what you want. Nothing is impossible. Nothing is impossible. A lot of you, you just need to start believing. You need to start believing in yourself. You need to start believing in God again. A lot of us guys, we have fallen astray. Over the lockdown, over the past few months, we've fallen astray because things have fallen apart. But the thing is, when things start falling apart, that is when you have to form together. So that you can rise above your circumstances. You can rise above all the calamities that you are facing. You can rise above all of the difficulties in your life. You can rise above your financial struggles. You can rise. And it all starts from within, guys. We love you from Tanzania. Thank you. Thank you. I'm coming there soon again. I love Tanzania. Love the people of Tanzania. Thank you. Thank you, guys. You can do it. Yes, there's somebody, Byron uh, London, Byron London, I think that's how I pronounce your name. He said, I can do this. Powerful. That's a powerful statement. Everybody who is on this live now, right now, there's 460 people constantly listening here. I want you to write down here, I can do this. I want you to write, to leave a content, to, sorry, to leave a comment right here now. Stating, I can do this. Thank you, Byron, for starting this chain. I can do this. I can do this. I want you to write this. I can do this. I want you to write this. Yes, Michaela is saying it. Yes, I can do this. Thank you for the motivation. Thank you. I can do this. Jane Idu is saying it. Uh, everybody is starting to say it. I can do this. This is it, guys. You know what we are doing right now? 470 people, whether you are typing it right here, whether you are saying it in your mind, whether you are saying it to the person around you right now, you're saying, I can do this. That means automatically you are channeling positive. Sorry about that, guys. Right now you are challenging, sorry, you are, challenge, you are, you are channeling 
positive energy into your minds. You are channeling positive energy into the atmosphere right now. That's what we are doing. This is what we are doing. We are not here to talk about other people. We are not here to to talk about things we have. We are here to empower each another. You can empower somebody right here just by saying this. Remember guys, there are 460 people, there are 470 people. Each person is reading what you are saying. I can do this. When you say I can do this, another person is also having confidence and they are also putting it down right here that they can do it as well. We can all do it guys. We are challenging ourselves. Challenge yourself for the week ahead. I want each person to challenge themselves and challenge themselves to do something that they've never done before. Be it exercising, be it a new innovation, be it trying something new, be it eating right, be it, uh, uh, be it forgiving somebody, do something new for the week ahead. This is what we are doing. I can do this. I can do this. I can do this. You are saying this. You are, you are putting it into the atmosphere. The atmosphere will react to you. Your mindset reacts to what you say. This is what you are saying, guys. This is, this is more powerful than money. This is more powerful than anything else that we can say. What you are doing right now, guys, you are helping yourself. You are helping others. This is powerful. This is really powerful. Thank you, guys, for this energy. Right now, by you just put in, I can do this. And thank you, Byron was the first person to say this. Uh, by you saying this, guys, you are not only uh, channeling good energy to each other you are doing it to me as well and you know guys the reason why i am saying this right is because when i have a tough day i still have tough days when i am down and out when i feel like everything around me is starting to crumble when i feel like i'm having a bad day or a bad week i say the same thing i start to 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 to, to channel positive energy into my mind I start to say positive things. I start to speak positive things into being. I start to say, I can do this. I can do this. There's nothing impossible. I can do it. I have the power within me. And that is what you must say. That is what you must keep on saying, guys. And you, you, know, you know the way around this? Whether things are good, whether things are bad, whether things are okay. I keep on saying it. Yes, Jeremiah twenty nine eleven. I can do it. Yes, I can do this. I can do all things. That's it. That's it. That's it. Lovely, guys. Lovely. This is powerful. What you're experiencing right here, right now, is more powerful than anything that has happened this week. What we are getting right now, the energy that we are getting this week, uh, sorry, right now, is more powerful than anything I've experienced this week from Monday right until now. This is the most powerful thing. There's 400 and 60 people right now on this live just putting out their positive energy. You, guys, if you can only understand the power of what is happening here right now, just power, positive energy being exerted into the atmosphere, being exerted onto this life. This is what we are doing, guys. I want to thank you. I want to thank you for this. I want to thank you for this. I want to thank you for helping another person on this live today. Because by you dropping a comment, by you saying this, I can do this, you're automatically empowering everybody else right now who's, who is listening to this and, and who, is, who is experiencing what we are seeing right now. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, guys. This is too powerful. I really appreciate this from the bottom of my heart. Whatever has happened, whatever you have experienced in the week, I want you to just put it all aside. Clear off the desk. Clear off the desk. Whatever is there, whatever clutter is there, I want you to clear it all off. Somebody just put something here right now. You just made me cry, brother, because I just lost my father, my three family men members. I'm sorry for your loss, but I... Pray that the Lord is with you and He will guide your path. You know, the Lord, I want to leave this with you. God gives the toughest battles to His strongest soldiers. So, so if you are facing something like, like, like losing a loved one or whatever it is, 
I want you to know that you need to seek the face of God for Him to empower you, to help you get through this. I want you, I want you to, to, just, to just, just seek His face. So guys, coming back to it, I want you to clear the clutter, whatever is on the desk, good or bad, and start off afresh. Just start the new week on a new note because you can do it. And as we said, as Byron started the chain and said, I can do this. Wherever you are, Byron, thank you for that. As he started the chain and said, I can do this. I want everybody to say, I can do this. Whatever it is, whatever you, you right now you're saying, I can do this. But together with that, there is something that you must be thinking about. And whatever you're thinking about, I declare over your life that you will be able to accomplish it. You will achieve it. You will conquer it. You will overthrow it. You will be stronger than it in this week. That is what I declare over your life. And these things are going to happen. Good things are going to happen. You can do this, guys. You can do this. So this is... This is just me coming here just to, just to empower you, just to raise up the energy in this place to, on this life for the week ahead. Get charged up, guys. There's always, there's always hope. There's always hope. I can do this. That's it. That's it. Keep it coming. Keep it coming. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you so much for this. This has changed somebody's life. Just by you dropping this comment, it has changed somebody's life right here. Thank you. Thank you, guys. There are many people who are going to listen to this live after this. I want you to also be channeled into a positive path. I want positive energy to fill you up because if you are reading the comments, I'm not sure if you can after this live. But you can also do this. Whatever is in your mind right now that you want to accomplish. If you want to take your family out of poverty, you can do this. If you want to achieve a degree, you can do this. If you have, want to have a multi-million rand business, you can do this. You can do it. Whatever you want to do in your life, you can do this. You can do it, guys. This is more powerful than anything. What we are doing right now is more powerful than anything out here. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I'm going to end this live now, guys. Have a blessed weekend. Stay safe. Godspeed. Godspeed. I'm out. J Money.